Kansas City Royals hosting the Arizona Diamondbacks. The D-backs are minus 125 on the money line. The Royals are plus 105. The over-under is nine runs. Arizona laying a run and a half are plus 135, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by two. Kansas City getting a run and a half are minus 160, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Davies pitched once against the Royals this year. Three and two-thirds, five runs, four earned. They won that game nine to five in Arizona. Heels... Heasley pitched once against the D-backs this year. Five innings, three runs, three earned. They lost that game 8-6 to six in Arizona. The Diamondbacks are 7-12 and 12 as a team with Davies on the mound. The under has hit in his last two games. The under is 12-6-1 in the games in which he pitches in. The Diamondbacks are on a three-game losing streak. They are 4-6 and six in their last 10, and they are 23-34 and 34 on the road. The Royals are on a one-game winning streak. They're three and seven in their last ten. They are thirty and thirty-four at home. They are one and two as a team with Healsley on the mound, and the under is two and one in the games in which he pitches in. <laughs> Head to head, the D-backs are on a three-game winning streak. The Royals are six and four against them in their last ten. The over has hit in their last three games. The over-under at nine is five and five. The over-under is five and five. There have been three one-run games in their last 10 meetings. The favorite winning the game by two minus a run and a half is seven and three. The D-backs are 69 and 52 on the run line. So there's 70, 17 games over 500 and the Royals are 58 and 66 on the run line. So they are eight games under 500. I'm going to go Diamondbacks with the money line, Diamondbacks laying the runs, and I'm going to go under in this game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.